Let us try to find out which one is a bigger number, e to the power pi or pi to the power e. Now e to the power pi equal to, if we apply a calculator, 23.1407, whereas pi to the power e equal to 22.4590. Both approximately. So you can see that e to the power pi is greater than pi to the power e. But we want to find out which one is bigger and without using calculator. Now we observe that 2 cube is greater than 2 square. 2 to the power 4 is also greater than 2 is square. 2 to the power 7 is greater than 2 to the power 5. What I mean to say is that if I take higher power then the number that we get is also higher. That is also true for exponential function. If x is greater than y then e to the power x is greater than e to the power y. What we mean is that e to the power x is a monotonically increasing function. In other words, if you increase value of x, e to value of e to the power x also increases. Uh, so you can see that e to the power pi is definitely greater than e to the power e. But I don't want e to the power e. I want e to the power pi greater than uh, pi to the power e. Now first of all let's prove that fx equal to e to the power x is a monotonically increasing function. We will apply calculus f dash x equal to d dx of e to the power x that's equal to e to the power x which is greater than 0. If f dash x is greater than 0 then we know that fx to be a monotonically increasing function. Therefore, fx equal to e to the power x is monotonically increasing function. Now, we want to prove e to the power pi is greater than pi to the power e. Can I write pi to the power e in terms of powers of e? Yes. That is, we want to prove e to the power pi is greater than e to the power log of pi to the power e. We just apply the formula. Uh, x equal to e to the power log of x of course if x is greater than 0 here so pi to the power e equal to e to the power log of pi to the power e that is e to the power pi is greater than e to the power e times log of pi okay we need to prove it now, as we said, e to the power x is monotonically increasing function. If uh, pi is greater than e to the power log of pi, sorry, if pi is greater than e log pi, then I know that e to the power pi is greater than e to the power e times log of pi. So we claim, so we claim that pi is greater than e times log pi. In other words, pi minus e to the power, sorry, pi minus e times log pi is greater than zero. Let's prove it. We start by defining another function, gx equal to x minus e times log of x. Of course, log with base e. Then, again we claim that g is monotonically increasing. Then g dash x equal to derivative of x is 1, derivative of log of x is 1 by x. Therefore, g dash x is greater than or equal to 0 if 1 minus e by x is greater than or equal to 0 or if uh, 1 is less, sorry, greater than or equal to e by x or if x is greater than or equal to e. Now, you know that pi is greater than or equal to e and in fact, this inequality will be strict if I take any x greater, strictly greater than e. Therefore, I can say that g is monotonically increasing.
So we conclude that G is monotonically increasing for x greater than or equal to E and G is strictly monotonic for x greater than or equal to E plus 1. Therefore, uh, G of pi is uh, greater than or equal to G of E plus 1. Sorry, it is strictly, so g of pi is strictly greater than g of e plus 1 and g of e plus 1 is greater than or equal to g of e. In case of g of e, I know that it might be equal as well, but g of e plus, g of pi, pi being greater than e plus 1, g of pi is strictly greater than g of e plus 1. That, that can be combined to write g of pi strictly greater than g of e. Now, how much is g of pi? g of pi is... Uh, pi minus e times log of pi g of pi is we just need to write x equal to pi so pi minus e times log of pi so pi minus e times log of pi is greater than g of e that is e minus e times log of e of course with base e and this is greater than and this is exactly equal to 0 because log of e with base e is 1. Therefore, uh, pi is greater than e times log of pi. Now, we know that uh, exponential are monotonically increasing. So, if pi is greater, then e to the power pi has to be greater than e to the power e times log of pi. And that again by property of logarithm is equal to uh, pi to the power e. Therefore, e to the power pi is greater than pi to the power e and we are done.